What up, Pendulum fam? Welcome to my office. Wanted to bring you our weekend update. I'm really excited to bring you a new environment. Welcome to Tips from the Armchair. Anyway, about that. Um, let's get into it. Weekend update time. We got a couple of things. Very important things, actually. Kind of some sad things, kind of some, well, exciting things, mostly for our coaches. So, bear with me. The first thing, August 12th is Coach George is gonna be going into the Fire Academy over at Rio Hondo. He's going to be starting that day, so that Friday before that will be his last day. Doesn't mean that that's gonna be his last day forever, but there is a possible chance that that may be happening. Because he is going to be going to the Fire Academy, if he ends up getting picked up after the Fire Academy, then he will no longer be working here. However, there are still hopes and plans that after he's done with this Fire Academy, 14 weeks, he will come back. So that's, that's number one. So losing Coach George for 14 weeks starting August 12th. The next one is August 14th. My wife, co-owner, Chris Gurton, is coming back to coaching on a new time to Pendulum, 10 a.m., Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Now, we understand that that Wednesday is an August 14th. Yes, we're starting at midweek because, well, we have kids and they're going to be starting school on the 12th and we want to be able to be there for that. Anyway, uh, she'll be starting that new program August 14th on Wednesday at 10 a.m. You asked for it, we're delivering, 10 a.m. is going to happen. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Now, I must tell you something very, very important. There is a chance that this class may get canceled if we do not have good attendance. So if you are some of the people that wanted this class, you have to show up. We're going to try all this. If it doesn't work, we're going to scratch it. Okay? So you should know about that. Is that if it doesn't work out, we may scratch the class because of attendance. So show up. Next up, August 28th. Coach Mon is going to be going on a month-long vacation where she's going to be traveling the world. She'll be coming back after that in a limited time format, uh, meaning that she's going to be coaching less days than she normally does. Um, and at that time, we were also going to be changing the weightlifting program. So the weightlifting program is going to get a timeout for a month, all right, meaning that that is going to be shut down for a month while she's gone. And then we're gonna circle it back and we're gonna bring it back in a new format. So be understanding that that's coming back and that will be available to all members that have the, uh, the membership option with weightlifting. It'll become a regular weightlifting class, not a club where you have to pay to get into it in advance. Um, so you, everybody will be able to take that and that'll be a special class time that will be taught by Mon and Astrid. So, uh, we're excited about that in the future. That's a couple months out. Uh, next up is on Thursdays for the entire month of August is Friends and Family Day. So that means if you do not read your emails, if you didn't receive an email and you only check Facebook videos or YouTube videos, guess what? We're having Friends and Family Week. Uh, not week, sorry, day. <laughs> Itch. Uh, Day, Friends and Family Day on Thursdays through the entire month of August. So what does that mean for you? That means that you can bring your friend or family member on a Thursday the entire month of August and they can join you for a workout for free. Anyway, that is that. Um, I hope you guys bring your friends out, family out. We've had people been like, hey Drew, can I bring my friend? We're like, uh, not necessarily how we work anymore. Uh, but now you can bring them on Thursdays for the entire month of August. Uh, yeah, hope that they come through. Next up is the kids' room. An update on the kids' room. As you can see that there's been construction going on, there is going to be a little bit more time that we have to experience as they uh, 
uh, continue to put new things up in there, new drywall um, up for the ceiling and for walls, new flooring, uh, because there was so much mold and so it was a bad situation. There was, the flooring was warped because of the water. Yeah, and, you know, toys got thrown out. It's, it was a full process, so, but it's safer. Okay, so we're excited about that and it should be fixed. So I'm sorry for the longer delay than we expected, uh, but it should be better than ever. All right, thank you for your patience on that. Lastly, if you also don't check your emails, we are running out a new, very new, exciting thing, and we're changing our name from CrossFit Pendulum to Pendulum Fitness. That name change is indicative because of we want to be able to help more people in Pasadena. So what does that mean? That means that uh, we're going to change our name from CrossFit Pendulum to Pendulum Fitness. We're also going to be um, changing the sign outside. We're going to change our website. We're going to be changing some different things. But just know that that's coming. All right, and uh, we'll be rolling that out here in the upcoming weeks to our social channels and to our website and all of these things. But the thing that we wanted to bring to you guys is that we understand that we are not just a CrossFit gym. We are more than a CrossFit gym. We have uh, our classic class. We have weightlifting. We have personal training. We have physical therapy. We do multiple things here. It's not just CrossFit. So we want to be able to help more people that may have not tried us because they were going to be scared by the name CrossFit. So we're changing that name to Pendulum Fitness to encompass more of what we are. We are not stopping being in a CrossFit affiliate. We are not changing our name from CrossFit Pendulum. We're not going to stop coaching CrossFit. We are doing all the things that we're doing. We're just changing the front-facing name. That's it. So that we can go out and help more people and impact more people across Pasadena. So that is, if you didn't check your email, that was a major update that we roll, rolled out a couple of days ago. So um, hope you got to check that. If not, there you go. There's your information right there. So that is what we have coming up at a glance. It's a very, very busy month. And just so you know, who's going to be coaching those classes that George used to occupy? No, not really. It's me. I'm going to be stepping back in. Um, 5 o'clock and 6 o'clock most days. Uh, to take care of those class times and then some of the other class times as uh, we need covered will be covered by some of the other coaches that we have on staff. So just know that things are not going to fall apart. We are going to keep forging ahead as we as we always have and always do. And um, I guess this would be the part that if you are a coach and you're interested in working here, let me know. Or if you're interested in getting started in coaching CrossFit, let me know. We do have a development program. So I hope that helps. Thank you so much for tuning in. And uh, welcome to the armchair. And just so you know, for all you Ohio State fans out there, I think this is going to be the year. I think it's going to be the year. College football is right around the corner. Anyway, thank you guys so much. Have a good day.